Okay. Remembering the ineffable. Uh, in this uh, context, we're going to be talking about black rain and uh, uh, night and fog. Now, the ineffable in itself is something that's uh, unexplainable, something that's just so powerful that cannot be uh, put to words. Uh, and this is a way in which film is really important uh, because film can create uh, a dialogue, uh, you know, it, it can portray things that, that uh, otherwise uh, people really can't put into words. And by this I mean, uh, let's talk about Night and Fog, you know, um, in the video the the camera goes through these camps um and even even the the filmmaker says you know it's pointless to even you know try to describe the things that happened here uh, and he goes through and he gives little you know like glances and snippets and you can see uh you know these piles of bodies you know being pushed by uh, a bulldozer you know and you don't need to speak German to know what was going on there. Uh, and uh, this all kind of ties into uh, film being uh, important because of the fact that it's intersemiotic uh, in the context that, uh, you know, these are, these are signs that we can all understand um, universally uh, without having to have a it narrated, uh, per se, to us. Uh, it's just, uh, you know, uh, it's 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 a hard topic. It is, um, but film as a vehicle to portray these uh, these kind of uh, ineffable uh, circumstances is really important. Because it's, you know, one of the only ways you could really truly go about doing it. Um, <laughs> you weren't there, so you wouldn't know. Uh, and the best way to to really portray that is to uh, is to kind of, you know, give those those haptic, you know, glances, uh, and uh, and to kind of it's it's a way in which you can put other people into your shoes. And uh, I can really think of no other way better to do that than through film as a medium.